Hello guys. So uh, this is second video for NMAT registration. Uh, so please understand there are two steps. One is uh, GMAT uh, registration, which you know, which we have already done that process. Second is you have to go on the website of NMIMS and register, you know, on that website also. There's a little complication. That is why I'm making this video. So I'm sharing my screen, guys. Yes, here we go. So see this scene. So when you type NMIMS, this is what you'll get. See, nmet.nmims.au. You click on this. You'll come across something like this. Now, what is important here? That Let us understand this now. Take care. On the right-hand side, in yellow color, you can see top corner, apply now. Take care. So you have to click on that, apply now. When I click on that, apply now, this is where it comes. Step one and step two. Before that, I will request all of you to go through all these, you know, various programs, various colleges and everything, right? Now, in this website, you know, this nmed.nmims.au, we'll see all the programs they offer, accreditations they offer and everything. So, make sure that you go through this, right? Various campuses and, you know, everything it is there. Now, today it is about registration. Now, step one and in this also, there is step one and step two, right? Same. So when you click things on this step one, you know, step one, trust me, it's, a, it's the same thing for GMAT. Wala thing. So what I did is when I when I filled this information, you know, step one ka information, it said you are already registered. So I put in another number, right? totally different number. And this is what I got. I'll show this to you. This is what I got. So when you follow step one, this is what you get. Complete your GMAC registration and pay the fee. So I used a different number, guys, to get this thing because I've already done my registration on the, the GMAC website, which is step one, which is basically the my previous video. So please make sure you go through the previous video and fill that complete process, right? Now, go through this now. Step It says there's number one, complete your GMAC registration, which you've already done, right? Because that is the step one. Number two, after receiving your GMAC ID, click step two and log in, right? Logically, they should have given that link somewhere here. Complete your GMAC registration. They should have given the registration process here only, na? which means you have to go back to that, you know, GMAC registration and do it. So why put step one here? Na? I, I don't understand this point. I'll be honest here, right? And then it asks you to go back to step two, which is already here. This is your step two. I hope you understand what I'm trying to say. This is step two. Aap is pe bhi click karo ge to, it will go to, yeah, it's the same thing. It will go to step two from here. Yeah, so this is step one, guys, which is nothing but my first video. Do that registration. Once your registration is over there, once you make payment there, what you what will happen is you'll get a GMAC ka ID. And using this GMAC ID, now I'm on step two. Huh? So I just stopped my sharing and reshared it here. Yeah. This is it, guys. So this is step two. On step two, when you begin NMIMS registration, then it will open a new page, which is the actual registration. And you have to enter your GMAC ID. So registered email, it I think it did not take, right? So that means GMAC ID is compulsorily required here entered your password and then uh, most of the information which you have filled in that ID, you know, when you fill the GMAC ID, it will extract from there, but then a few additional details will be required, right? So this is one point, guys. Now, here we go. What I'll do is I'll show you. See, there are two things which are important in NMIMS registration, guys. Yeah, you know? Point number one: only the first test will be considered for NMIMS, which means whichever is your first test will be considered for your NMIMS. Next point is: uh, in what sequence do you want to or should you fill the? Uh, should you or the preference which you should give? Uh, for all NM programs, right? They will ask you. So that is something which I would like to tell you now. So here we go. Just hold on. 
sharing my screen to show this to you. Here we go. Yeah. So the preference in which people should fill this is NM Mumbai, then HR, then digital science, then NM based on the cutoff, basically, right? Uh, NM Bangalore, then NM Manavi Mumbai, and then digital transformation, business analytics, and MBA Indo. Right. Now, why I'm telling you in this manner is because these are the cutoffs, so better college. Uh, has been ranked above so this you can take a screenshot put it in this in this manner but if you have a separate preference you can do that so no issues right so this is it from my side guys uh thank you so much bye bye